I just cut out from expat rights and this is something really important. The Chinese government right now is soliciting feedback on their new regulation for foreign teachers. So technically they're going to be listening to us and they want us to communicate with them. And there's just one issue. There's one thing I believe that's the most important and that we need to communicate to them that we should. And that's the problem with release letters and how release letters leave you tied to your employer who in, in many cases simply refuses to give one without a lengthy legal battle when they have every advantage where they can stall for time, where they can use the release letter simply as a weapon to stop you from switching to a better job. And I know lots of teachers who are struggling with companies that are not giving the release letter or holding on or fighting or using it as a weapon to abuse their foreign teachers who have given notice. Uh, hell, not even not even teachers, <laughs> any any job or uh, any employment in China. But they're the Chinese government right now is soliciting feedback on the regulation for teachers and us expats. We need to come together and give them one thing to hear, let them hear one thing, give them one message and tell them that the release letter situation is complete bullshit. And so many foreign people have been completely fucked over by the release letters. And if China wants to have foreign teachers and if they want to have foreigners here enjoying themselves and not leaving and, and educating their children, you know, if this is something they actually want, then the one thing that they need to do is especially is a focus on the release letter shit. So I, I'm asking everyone who sees this, I'm asking all foreign people to leave the feedback, to, to follow the instructions uh, in this article and simply say the release letters need reform the release letter policy needs reform where you where you do not end up as a hostage to your employer